And now your first Horn 5 forecast, certified most accurate by weather rate. Good morning, Mid Michigan. Happy Sunday. I hope your weekend has been going well so far. Now we've had more of this spring like weather this weekend. I hope you enjoyed it yesterday, especially it was a nice day out there. We eventually broke into some sunshine. Now as for today, we'll just have even more of that sunshine even right now, starting off with this live look here across the bricks in downtown Flint. A bright and beautiful morning out there. Also that earlier sunrise now because daylight savings time uh, did come to an end overnight now. So Right now in Flint, it's 42 degrees, still chilly despite all of that sun. Feels like 39 because of a southwest wind at five miles per hour. But for today, highs will outdo yesterday by quite a bit. Nearly 10 degrees will be into the 60s by later on this afternoon. We're all dry out there this morning too. the first one. Five pinpoint Doppler live from MBS. Nice and quiet. High pressure still in control of our weather here around mid Michigan on the first one. Five sky tracker. We have two main areas of high pressure that are off to our east and our south. Now the backflow behind the southern one is what's going to continue to bring the southwesterly breeze into mid Michigan, which is funneling a lot of that milder air in. We also do have a a weak cold front that is off to our west here in South Dakota. A weak system in general there. There's not much moisture for it to feed off of, but eventually that will make its way to mid-Michigan, bringing us some smaller shower chances for our Tuesday. But let's go through the first one five hour by hour, show you what we're talking about for today. And we can see it's going to be pretty quiet. Plenty of sunshine through the morning, your lunch hour and the afternoon. A few high level fair weather clouds will pass through, but Overall, it's going to just be a nice and bright day out there. This is your dinner hour, even carrying those mostly clear skies into the overnight hours tonight as well. Then for Monday, it's pretty much just a repeat of today. We'll have plenty of sun in the morning as you're waking up there. More sunshine at your lunch hour before a few more fair weather clouds build in in the afternoon. I think we'll see a few more clouds tomorrow afternoon than we will today, but still overall just a nice day today and a perfect start to the week for tomorrow. Now that cold front that I did mention that's going to move through following that we're going going to have just a little bit of a blip of cooler air behind that. We can just barely see it on the jet stream here. That'll be in Iowa by around Tuesday afternoon. That cold air eventually making its way through, which is where that shower chance does come from and a little bit of a cool down after that as well. Now I think the wider view on the first one five hour by hour, I think it's overdoing these showers just a little bit on Tuesday, but you get the idea. We'll have some shower activity moving through the area. Not an all day thing either, but we'll definitely be on the lookout for uh, some wet weather around the area on Tuesday. Highs will be into the 50s though after that cold front passes through and then especially dropping down into the 40s by this upcoming weekend as well. But today let's just get out there and enjoy it. A nice day high of 61 degrees with the southwest wind at 5 to 10 miles per hour tonight. We'll have a low of 43 degrees, even milder than the last few nights as well. And that wind still coming out of the southwest at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Now Kendall on the 7 day forecast here, those temperatures again just cooling down into next weekend. We could have some snow mixing in there as well. Oh no. But overall, <laughs> yeah, overall let's just enjoy the weather for today. <laughs> Absolutely.